What up, YouTubers? It's time for another DVD Madness. Today we're going to be doing a review of The Seventh Voyage of Sinbad. Watched this a couple days ago. It came out of my uh, Ray Harryhausen um, signature series or collector set. Um, this is the first of the Sinbad movies, I believe. And it's, you know, like the other ones, it's heavy in the claymation or stop motion animation. Um, but anyways, the basic, you know, story of this is you have a hero who is Sinbad. He's kind of like a, um, it's kind of like a, kind of like Indiana Jones, kind of. You know, he's, uh, probably more of a ladies' man than Indiana Jones is, but he's an action guy. He's really good at sword fighting, he's good at, you know, general fighting, but he's still smart, and um, he's just a good all-around hero kind of guy. Um, the, the gentleman who plays him, I actually don't know who that is, I haven't looked it up. Kerwin Matthews, possibly, does a fantastic job of playing Sinbad. And the basic basis of the story is um, Sinbad goes out meets a wizard guy that has a lamp and there's a genie in the lamp so you can make wishes and um, you know basically they lose the lamp uh, to a big huge cyclops guy which is right here and um, they end up trying to go back to this island to get the get the lamp and a bunch of stuff happens and um, I don't want to give away the storyline but um, Basically, they end up fighting and a bunch of action scenes and whatnot. Uh, for this movie, I think the, the the animation is done just awesome. You know, Ray Harryhausen, everything I've seen, he does uh, very very well. It's the first time in a long time in a long time that I've seen any of his color movies. I've been watching more of the black and white stuff recently, and I was a little worried at how it would transfer over to color, but it does really really well. Um, you know, there's a multiple fight scenes. Um, there's a scene where the magician turns a lady, puts a lady and a snake in a box and turns it into a, turns her into like a snake woman or something. It's just tons of movement and stuff. I just can't imagine how long it would have taken to, to put it together. On top of that, the sound is done really well. We got a cat here bugging us. Uh, the sound is done really, really well. And the acting is surprisingly good. I'm not going to say it's great acting, but it's surprisingly good. This movie definitely, you know, hit a high note with me. I thought it was it was very good. I went into it with high expectations and it and it blew those away. I'm going to give this one an 8 out of 10 skulls. Um, it's the highest rating I've given out so far. I've only done about 5 or 6 reviews, but 8 out of 10 is um, Definitely, definitely a very, very good movie. I'd recommend to anybody to pick this up. It's really, really, it's done really well. You know, like I said, special effects, acting, music, um, and it's just a, a super, super fun, fun, fun watch. And I'd say it's good from ages from probably very young to very old. Everybody's gonna, everybody will enjoy this one. Um, so yeah. That's all I got for you this time. Thanks for watching.